Yeah, sometimes don't. you don't. <laughs> you can't change this. Oh. No. What? Isn't this? You don't have my consent. <laughs> This is already. So I've been learning some of the songs. You guys, mm -hmm. I've been learning some of the songs here from Saskatchewan, Manitoba, North Dakota, Minnesota, the uh, Cree, um, Sioux, Ojibwe, um, Sioux. But I've been learning some of the songs from the northern tribes up here. I guess where they're at now. Anyway, so I was re uh, I got interested and I started to look at some of the yeah, southern tribes and I ended up finding some of this uh, some of the songs from the Pueblo and Hopi. I found here this song over here. This song and dance. <laughs> And I was looking at the, the headdress and the, the colors um, and some of the style. And I was thinking, well, that really reminds me of uh, Mexico. It reminds me of kind of the Mexican um, style. And... And so... They're from here, and which makes sense because Mexico, well, this all used to be one place with no borders, um, but um, I guess as the United States was growing and beginning, all of this was all, well, Mexico still. So, but I just thought that was really beautiful, and I was talking to my father about it, and he said, well, but remember that the... The Aztecs that started Mexico, the, uh, Tenochtitlan, here from Mexico City, the history was that they'd come down from the north somewhere, they'd come down from Aslan, and they had moved down into this area, and they're on the search for the, the eagle and the snake, but, but they, they had started up in the north. Well, I thought that was really interesting, considering the way that like some of this looks very Aztec, or I guess you could say Aztec looks somewhat like this. Um, and then I started researching further and I was watching a video on the Pueblo Indians and look what I found. A video about the Pueblo and I saw this name right here. Holy Mole. And I was thinking, well, wait a minute. Is there more Mondragons down there? And then found another video. A video celebrating a, a Marine coming home. Back to the reservation, back to the tribe. And there he is. And look at that last name. What? Did you miss it? Mondragon. What? So then I kept researching because that's just amazing. Maybe there's some connection far, 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 far in the past. Taos Pueblo. The Taos Pueblo Tribal Government has announced the names of new officials for 2015. Here, Tribal Secretary, Secretary Antonio Mondragon. Uh, members of the war, uh, the war chief is elected and members of the war chief staff. Uh, where'd he go? Jason, Mo or Lloyd Jason Mondragon. What? Maybe something's happening. And then just today, I researched and I found some of the Indian scroll, the federal Indian scrolls, uh, Indian, federal Indian census it was called. Uh, now they call it Native American census rolls. Um, and look what names I started to find. What? What are their names? So here, well, there's one even older than that. Mondragon, buddy. Here, Mondragon, 1899, Native American, New Mexico census rolls. What? So that's where we're at right no! now. No! Holy moly.